It just, it just follows It's still me. moving towards him. Yeah, get. It's still moving towards him. No fucking way, Ow. bro. Ooh. What Ooh. the hell? Welcome back to the scariest TikTok slash YouTube short slash videos in the world? Question mark. Number Hi, Josh. Four. 180. Hi, Eddie. Wait, what are we doing? We're looking at scary videos again. Do you haven't been on my channel in a while? Uh, scary videos? Are you serious? Yeah, and every time I see you, you look more like a daddy. Scary TikToks with Eddie. Hang on, bro. Oh, wait, what We're the gonna do this right, dude. We're gonna do this right, bro. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> I recognize that blanket. It's just a little blankie. Did you take one of my tortillas? I would never take... No, you're right. I, I pinched this out of your pantry right before Gabby started cooking one up. <laughs> we could be tortilla buddies. We are tor tortilla oh, sorry. buddies. Tortilla hermanos. Josh, you ready for the first one? Do I look ready? Yeah. If you, Look, today we're going to be looking at... <laughs> you actually do look ready. You look ready for yeah. ghost hunting. You look ready to like start praying. You look, you look ready to just be 100% total Mexican ghost hunter. Dios mio. Exactly. All right. If you guys want to submit your scariest uh, TikTok slash YouTube shorts, any video that you want to send me, uh, do it in the link in the description. The Scary Eddie subreddit is almost at 200,000 members, and that's kind of funny. All right. Here we go. Let's watch the first one. Right. My heart jumped. Uh. <laughs> 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 this is why you can't trust anything on the internet, cabrones. The top video is the edited one. The bottom one's the raw footage. Oh, f <laughs> Are you all right, Josh? Are you all right, Josh? Yeah, I think I forget to take my blood pressure medication today. Everything's hitting me twice as hard, dude. Here, have a look at the new upcoming brush plush with the VR Whoa! headset attached to it. Check him out. Look, he'll make you feel better. Look at him. Dude, that looks awesome. Removable VR headset. Oh, he He's comes got... with a free headset? He comes with a free headset. And, and he holds little cup noodles on him. See? Dude, that's he literally awesome 2019. He looks absolutely fucking blasted. Look at his little brain, bro. <laughs> look at look at his brain sticking Don't out. Don't touch this... the soft spot, man. <laughs> this is exactly what we look like coming out of VR videos. Is this spirit box? Cheese, girl? Yep. Whoa, shit. You scared? You scared? You scared? You're dead. What the hell did you say, boy? There you go again, moaning. Why you keep moaning? Who's getting the cheese clap? Come possess this dog, I clap your cheeks disrespectfully. Disrespectfully. What? You're next to me. <laughs> sit down, motherfucker. <laughs> oh shit. What the? What I hit? Where's that old bitch at? Hello, old bitch. You know, my birthday's coming up. You don't care. Man, fuck you. You don't care either, man. Fuck you. That's why you're dead. <laughs> the Lord is great. He cares for the humble. But he keeps his distance from the proud. Well, was that someone screaming? Yeah, it's working, huh? I'm going to buy some holy water. I'm going to get some sage. Because I'll order that. As soon as I finish recording this video, I'll go order it. No more what you say? Then you said no more money. I fucking got money. What are you talking about? Puro de alas. That's yeah, exactly. Puro de alas, way. <laughs> What's up, fool? What you doing, fool? If you want to talk to me, yes or no? It's for yes. That's for no. Ghost foods. If you stay quiet, that means you're a bitch. I guess you're a bitch, man. <laughs> Am I a doctor? No, you dumbass. I'm a ghost fool. A ghost fool. Ghost I'm a ghost fool. fool. I'm not a doctor. Hey. Listen, babe, I'll throw you on this bed and, and clap them cheeks and break this f***ing table right here. Yo, she just moaned. Yeah, she I'm the only demon here, bitch. Say in your house, you don't pay rent? <laughs> hey, no, nah, you leave, motherfucker. <laughs> She's telling me to leave. Where am I supposed to go? Bye-bye. That was like when you give Molly the spirit box, dude. You start talking about clapping their cheeks. Just general disrespect. Yeah, it's just... Uh, so this guy, like, he does spirit box content like that. And all he does is just make fun of whoever's talking through the spirit box. And he'll have, like, full-on conversations about them having to pay the rent and shit. And he'll have the Annabelle doll there with him. It's actually pretty funny. Damn, he's getting some pretty, like... If it's real, 
He's getting some clear vocals coming through, huh? Listen to you, man. If it's real, like you've changed, bro. No, bro. The whole Sam and Kobe thing's got me like the just just experiencing it all firsthand, right? Has like d definitely mm. changed our perspectives a lot. I oh, definitely, dude. I feel like some sort of Mexican nun. Yeah, well, you kind of do look like one. You look like a Mexican monk. Ah, oh, cabrón, cabrón, la llorona. Please, thy heavenly taco deliver us these scary tiktoks deliver us from farts and shits deliver us from eating from this farts good and food -poo why do you always disappear at 11 59 at midnight it starts messing with me that's a good transition <laughs> oh <laughs> Got him! Got him! <laughs> Wait, did you, have you seen this before? I selected these for you, Josh. Oh, you son of a bitch, dude. Why are you always going to jump scare me, dude? I'm wearing the blanket of protection, dude. But listen, man, I, I pre-selected these just to just for to see your reaction to them. Because, uh. because listen, the state of the subreddit is pretty shit right now. And I don't want to sit here <laughs> for hours like cringing with you. I can't believe that got me, dude. Bitch, I hope a spider crawls up your ass, bitch ass motherfucker. Bitch ass motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like fucking scared. How is this um, possible? There is no one standing yeah. there. There's a, a person shadow? standing uh, there. A silhouette, like a shadow of- Ah, uh, this is a compilation <laughs> one. <laughs> if you came here to kill me, clap your hands. Well, that wasn't clapping your hands. That was more like just. Okay, I'm so. So these are clearly fake. Yeah. The shadow one was kind of weird, though. Yeah, we'll go back to it. <laughs> Whoa, what the fuck? That kind of got oh, me. Oh wait, dude. was there a face? I actually didn't see those. This one. What's the cover, dude? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, of course that's editing, it's, it's bro. Video editing, but it, it got me, dude. <laughs> it's a PNG of a fucking baby. My bad. Baby. My bad. That's fucking funny, though. Creepy neighbors. And I look up and I see my neighbors. What are they doing? Oh. <laughs> they all turned like around that. at the same time and looked out when the light that's came back on. That would scare the <laughs> out of me, dude. I'd be moving uh, hell. Absolutely, bro. To talk about trick or treating. Like, hell no, that's the house you stay away from. I uh, may or may not have climbed up. I was exploring there's a jail. No stairs. There's no stairs. You have to climb up, he oh. said. Oh, that's going to be something one of those jail cells. I'm getting ready for it. Yes, I was, cabron. Yes, I was. Oh, oh, shit. It was like a little shadow figure. Yeah, it was like a shadow right there. It's like a man standing there. Exactly. Bye -bye. Nope, I'm out. F that. F that house. Yeah. Burn it to the ground. Look at that That's thing, the right man. Thing to do. She looks like she's got some creepy stuff around the house, so probably just her dress up. She's definitely like dressing up for this shit. I don't know what this is, dude, but like, uh, after 12 hours, the flesh nodule. After 12 hours, the flesh nodule has extracted all toxic negative emotions from the body and is removed. Antibiotics prevent infection in the customer. Embrace serenity, negative emotion extraction. Book your treatment today at siliconesound.com. I can't tell. Is that, a, do you think that's an AI video? What are you showing me, dude? I have Last no, time bro, I was on your channel, it was like ring things and skinwalkers. Now it's like <laughs> little skin crawlers ripping people's wrists apart and emo girls looking at scary predators down the stairway. What's going on on this channel, uh, man? What's it, happening? It's evolved, man. It's gone from skinwalkers to skin crawlers. I can see that. I ain't scared of no ghost. I ain't scared of no ghost, she says. Oh, is this something moving? Oh, the fan's moving. I ain't scared of no ghost. Oh, shit. Everything's moving. They got scared by the door. God, they're freaking out too. Yeah, man. What happened? I ain't scared of no ghost. Huh? <laughs> Stupid oh little God. gremlins. The channel just turned into bullying of me and children. Oh, let's go explore. I wonder what it was. 
Get your phone out. Seaster. Is that legit though? Because there was, look, the flowers were moving and everything. Everything in the house was moving. Uh, my it's theory, my theory is that it was a gust of wind because the flowers are moving in the center. See, and then the. Possibly. And then after the door closes, the, the flowers stop moving, and so does the fan. I think it's more likely it was a ghost. Probably, right? Yeah. Let's just, uh, let's just blame everything on ghosts. Yeah. It's the simple, it's the easy way out. 9-11, ghosts. Now this one, you got two camera angles, alright? You got the guy on the mm -hmm. bottom, and the and the, what he's filming at the top. And this accordion's just playing itself. Check this out. What the fuck? <laughs> I can't debunk this one, man. I feel like you need to put a lot of pressure on those to play them, right? Oh, I've, I've played an accordion before. It is it is like, it takes some strength, for sure. What is the story behind this video? No clue, but I like that he's showing, like, different angles of what's happening. How is this even possible? Like, if they were trying to fake it, how would they? And it looks like an old... Accordion, right? Yeah, I saw some people saying there could be like an animal inside of there that's like trying to get out, but nah, that's the, you can't do that because then accordion sounds work with air. So if you stick anything inside an accordion, then the sound won't be the same. It'll sound muffled. That's fucking weird, dude. That's creepier than a self-playing piano in my eyes. It's just like the thing's just moving. It's like a worm. Yeah, that one I can't debunk. That's that's just creepy. By the way, here's a uh, hairless Elmo. I didn't need this today, dude. <laughs> I did not need this. I just wanted to show you hairless Elmo. That's that's just like uh, I had the uh, disappointing moment of seeing Elmo, and I just wanted you to see it as well. A lot of dust. <laughs> that's a nervous um, laugh. Okay, so this yeah looks like it used to be like part of the um um like restaurant area, and then the bar is actually back over there. Um, but I set up a rim pod, uh, the spirit box is over there with the Tesla coil, and then there's another rim pod. Oh, this just got all the equipment. Whoa. Right here. Whoa. What the hell was that? What the I don't know how people do this by that? themselves. I couldn't. It's bad enough with, us, it, man. with all five of us, man. Remember the hospital moment where we were all downstairs in the kitchen? Yeah. And we yeah, heard the, the door, door slam. slam and I still then, don't know what happened there, man. I still got no idea. I I don't know either, dude. And like that was one of the scariest moments for me. Like in underneath in, in the in the hospital kitchen, just thinking that there was someone in the hospital with us that could be alive. And like, yeah. The, both both options were bad. Either homeless crackhead or actual main spirit i can't wait for people to watch the lighthouse video i can't wait to see what people find in it if there was oh, anything yeah. we missed yeah 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 with the spirit box and everything it's gonna be killer the lighthouse video we had to do a separate reaction to all of the footage that we filmed to explain to you guys because the shit that happened in the lighthouse video like was one thing but then coming to like watching the footage afterwards similar to the way we did in the um in the conjuring house when we would go into the kitchen to review what we had uh to discuss what we had seen we came back to my house and we watched the footage back and we had to do and like there was an hour long recording of us going through the raw footage and reacting to the shit that we picked up and saw because that it was it's unexplainable shit that ain't right okay this one is my most sent clip for the last couple of weeks so i haven't actually watched the whole thing i just saw that it had been sent to me a bunch so i just picked it out for us all right i um i usually don't record while i'm on the job um but this is freaking me out it's sort of unreal um here at work i'm here in the janitor's closet uh yeah, let me just show you guys. Mm. Cabron, first of all, that is the most backrooms looking backroom school I've ever seen. Yeah, I think I think like in, in order of creepiness, it goes like hospital, mental asylum, school. If you're in any of those abandoned or by yourself, it's just weird, dude. Yeah, and also on the scale of creepiness, you have like if the place is extremely dirty and ransacked, it's creepy, but also on the opposite side of the spectrum, if it's spotless, squeaky, clean, and empty, it's also f***ing creepy. Agreed, yeah. Alright. God, being a janitor? 
and like going to schools at night. An overnight It'd janitor. Oof. Yeah. Um, just to, I don't know, let you guys know this school was built on a cemetery. Um, Golf. I don't know if that helps my situation or not. But no, it doesn't. Previous janitors that have worked here have tried to tell everyone that, you know, every night something happens, some, some spooky shit, Gift. I don't know, paranormal or whatever you want to call it. And you still it, decided to work there. Yeah, I didn't really believe him until tonight. Um, I was in here cleaning up after some students had thrown a party, but um, what's been freaking me out is this one right here. That's some Pennywise shit, man. I don't uh, like it. No matter where I'm at in the classroom or what I decide to what? do, it what just follows fuck? me. And Get fucked. It does not follow you. you. Stupid balloon. I got you on camera now, so let's just... uh. Mm, see? That right there. Um. Shit. It's actually moving. If it comes around that corner, I don't know. Ah, oh, no fucking way, bro. Josh, come back. You have to watch, Josh. Oh, man. You've shown me a lot of creepy videos, dude. But I don't understand no, no, what the no. fuck is happening here. Oh, wait. Somebody pushed it, right? Look, 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 look. Right, right there. It gets pushed. Boom. You see that? It's like someone bumps it from behind the wall. You could see it moving by itself, though, when he was in the room with it. See? No, no, no. How did it get around the corner? It just, it just follows like It's still me moving right towards him. It's yeah, still moving towards him. Don't, no How? fucking way, bro. <laughs> what Whoa. the hell? Oh, Wait. Whoa, did you see that? What the fuck was that? That was too fast to be a person, man. Ooh. Uh, uh, bro. No, that was freaky. That was probably one of the creepiest videos I've seen on the internet. Me too, man. What the fuck? Bro, the fucking red balloon? How do you debunk this shit, huh? Because if you're using a string, then the top wouldn't move like that. Like around the little around the little sack on the bottom. But then how are you making it turn corners? And yes, you're right. The top wouldn't just like wobble forward as it did. That's what I mean. It goes around the corner. Like it doesn't curve around the corner. It goes st like right angle. Yeah, it like it turns, right? That school needs another janitor. Bro. I'm telling you, that dude's out of there. That dude's fucking out. And this reminds me of like this reminds me of what happened in the lighthouse when Juicy was like, there's something behind Dose. And then we couldn't see it until we afterwards. It. We had to check the thermal camera and there was someone behind Dose. That's a good one, man. That's a really good one. I wonder if that dude's posted anymore. Uh, let me see. It has been brought to our attention that there's a video posted on your social media account known as Ski, uh, uh huh, which has caused concern amongst members of our community. Oh, the parents must have freaked out. While we respect your right to free speech and expression, it is important to note that as a representative of our school, your actions and words reflect on all of us. As a result, we strongly urge you to remove the video in question from your social media account as soon as possible. Too late, mate. It's on the internet now. It's f***ing everywhere down It's now, everywhere dude. now, bro. Man, oh, that is man. crazy, dude. Imagine noticing that. Like, he was cleaning the room in there. He must have been in there earlier cleaning the room. Then he turns around. Red balloon's closer. He turns back. He's oh, like, oh, that's weird. Oh, dude, Starts, imagining like, the moment. mopping the floor. Yeah, mopping the floor. He turns back. It's closer again. He's like, is my f brain playing tricks on me right now? The balloon oh. is right behind him. <laughs> that would have been horrible dude <laughs> imagining the moment before the video is even scarier yeah. mom thought her daughter had an imaginary friend till she cut this on video i hate kids with imaginary friends man they're lonely i don't give a f they're scary look at this what the hell something tugged on her treats Would have actually grabbed it. 
the thing with little kids, man. You can't get them to like act that shit. Yeah, you're not gonna get, especially like how how do you like that's an actual tug. Like the way she's like pulling back, it's like something's yeah. resisting her tug as well. You can't fake that. It, it like it pulls her off balance. See? Yep. Even the second time when it grabs her toy, it pulls her forward a couple steps. She just said, nah. That would have been a weird thing to go back and watch on camera and be like, oh, f I better send this to Eddie. <laughs> I better send this to Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this girl. She looks like you in makeup, dude, when we did that hide and seek video. <laughs> I'm telling you, edit it, edit, throw it up. Yo, it looks like Eddie in makeup. Nah, I didn't, nah, bro. I was prettier. When the audience sends her to me, they actually just cut out her explanation and show her for one frame, and then go straight to the video she's trying to show. Hell yeah! But this time, talk about one of the creepiest included. Mexican analog horrors: the Selena Delgado broadcast. Now, before I show you the video, let's break it down a little bit. Now, the Selena Delgado broadcast was a broadcast that allegedly happened on Canal 5 during the segment called Al Servicio a la Comunidad, which translates to In Service to the Community, which was a missing people's broadcast during the late 1990s to the early 2000s. And this segment would cut between Wait. commercials to help spread the word on missing people. I've seen that picture before. In the I know, me too. Stuff. Is it from, is it actually from a missing persons report? I don't think so. I think it's from a, I think it's a drawing that a police officer did of a suspect. Who was a woman that went missing on April 22nd in Alvaro Obregón, Mexico City. But allegedly, during her broadcast, which apparently cut during a kid's TV show, her picture gets interrupted by this. Desde 18 años, se extravió el 22 de abril en la delegación Álvaro Obregón. Selena Delgado López se ignora su paradero desde el 28 de mayo del año 2000. That's that can't cap. be real, man. That's cap. That can't bro. be real. You can't be f***ing posting that. That's cap. But yeah, apparently, according to some commenters, their moms like saw this happen in real life, and others just say oh, that it's the best analog it. horror. But listen, real or not, that picture gave me nightmares. That's like the craziest uncanny valley I had have ever seen. I. I don't know what to think. Um, but what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. You gotta yeah. ask your parents, dude. You have to do it. I have to, have have to, to ask, ask my parents and see if they saw the Canal 5 broadcast. Yeah. And be like, have you seen this before? Hang on. I have to I have to look this up now. <laughs> Canal 5 full video. Okay, I got the full video here. I, I remember this f***ing commercial, bro. No way. Look how creepy this commercial is, bro. It talks about uh, fleas. Crazy fleas, and you gotta like pick the little fleas up from the game. <laughs> bed bugs. Oh, it's called bed bugs. Yeah. All right. Here's the here's the broadcast. Bullshit, there was 60 seconds of- Yeah, it's just- it's just him talking for 60 seconds. What the f*** is going on here? Is that real? This is weird, man. I could have sworn that that's a- that that's a police drawing of a suspect. Have you seen the stuff that, uh, Pixar's connected to horror movies? No. Lies Pixar is connected to a famous horror movie. In Coco, you can see a painting of the twins from oh, The Shining. Shit. Sid's house has also the same pattern rug as the Overlook Hotel. Oh, shit. That's cool. Also, check this out. A license plate in Toy Story 3 refers to room 237 from the movie. <laughs> but wait for the best part. Again in Coco, you can spot a red drum. Red drum, right. <laughs> so what's the link between The Shining and Pixar? That's a weird one, huh? That's just weird, right? It's I mean, across multiple movies, too. The red drum is a uh, stretch. Yeah, the other stuff is say. The other stuff's kind of interesting. Mm. Oh, what the f*** is this, bro? That's <laughs> I just clicked on it. Wait, what the f***? <laughs> oh, I like this. They do, like, weird... Lights are off, Really yeah. good-looking 3D render stuff. What would, you do? <laughs> what would you do, man? What would I do? I'd first ask what that mouth do, homie. 
No, you wouldn't. You're just going to wrap yourself run. up like a burrito, dude, and roll uh, straight I, out the door. I don't know, man. I keep a gun by my bed. I, I'd be I'd be scared to even reach for that. If your kid starts talking to an imaginary friend, be very careful. Here's why. Can I just, like, say, first of all, like, am I the first, like, scary content creator that isn't f***ing sounding like they're a walrus with smoker's cough? <laughs> I was not my mother discovered you just that the girl. girl. A mother by the name Diana went to the kitchen with her daughter Allie to grab some milk when suddenly her daughter began talking to someone she can't see. Hola. ¿A quién le dices hola? Hola, niña. <laughs> As she asks her who this girl is, Diana makes a horrifying discovery. Allie says that she's been talking and playing with a one-year-old girl in her room for some time. Shocked upon hearing her daughter talking to a newborn girl, she shows a picture where Allie was five months old and captured the ghostly figure of a newborn girl. That one's a stretch. That one's a stretch, but... The Eric? kid, like the kid talking to the little girl, you can see, like you can see the reaction of the mom. I'm a firm believer that like around the age of seven, I think kids can see shit, man. There is too oh, yeah. much shit out there. Ask any parent, like new parent, if their kid says anything weird and they all have a story about something mm -hmm. weird, dude. I used to see a man up the stairs in the, in the house in Mexico when I was a baby, my mom tells me. And then my sister used to see someone in the closet and she used to like, we all used to sleep in the same room my grandma's house and she used to like crawl under the blanket all the way down to like the the foot section of the bed because she was so scared of the man that was in the closet staring Jesus at her Christ. yeah See, usually you think of kids coming up with stuff it would be imaginary friends that they like it's when they start being like i don't like that man that scares the shit out of me man if oh, i had a little kid dude. and they were like i don't like the man that lives in the closet i'd be like all right you're gonna have to find me home sorry kid kids if you're seeing shit get some schizophrenic medicine please there's some there's an easy way to solve this we could just get rid of kids that's true you know the question is how guns <laughs> <laughs> okay. <We're laughs> and birth control. <laughs> You're starting to sound like an American now, dude. We saw some scary videos today, Josh. We did. What did you think? Did you think that uh, that these weren't as shit as you thought? I think that was pretty good. The red balloon one got me. Uh, me too, man. The red balloon one? Bravo. Worth the entire video for me. Whoa, hey. This can is floating next to me, dude. No Whoa, what the hell? El Padre, el Hijo, el Espíritu ah. Santo. Vete al pinche demonio, ah. pinche red vulcán. Por favor, por favor, por favor, por favor. Amen. It's... I stopped floating. That must have worked. Thank you. Glad I could help. All right, we're going to go watch some uh, spooky, funny videos in Josh's Discord. So we're going to change the pace. But I'm going over to his channel, so go check that out. I'll see you guys there. Let's get old. I love y'all. I'm going to see you next time. Bye.